Welcome to the new iPhone app. Hemocalc by ICU Wizard, LLC. The ICU Wizard, LLC calculator was created for intensive care nurses that deals with pulmonary artery catheter. And for bedside clinician, they transform complex hemodynamic parameters. into a simple and easily understandable pressure readings that is automatically assigned by the hemodynamic calculator. The ICU Wizard LLC hemodynamic calculator has a product name HemoCalc under iPhone apps. To locate the application tap the iPhone app store icon. For a faster search tap the search icon. Then type in, in the search box HemoCalc or hemodynamics calculator. Once you have located the application, download the product to your iPhone. Locate and tap the calculator icon at the lower left side area of the application. Type in the basic data of the patient. It is important that the height and weight be filled in. That is, to get the body surface area or BSA of the patient. Now fill in the bedside parameters, please note that this fields are required. Systolic blood pressure, diastolic blood pressure, the map will be computed for you. CVP, PA systolic pressure, PA diastolic pressure, heart rate, cardiac output and the SVO2. After putting in all the parameters tap the compute button and swipe the screen to the left see the computed hemodynamic parameters. Interpreting your parameters. The CVP represents your right atrial pressure. It describes how much fluid you have available when the myocardial muscles is at rest. And within normal limit values is in blue. Abnormal values is in red color. PA pressure represents and describe the available or the assumed fluid volume at the left ventricle when the heart muscles is at rest. To describe the efficiency of your heart muscles, you may use the contractility parameters. To relate the physical use of contractility parameters is to simply understand the concept of Starling law. More stretch, more blood volume and less stretch, less blood volume. The cardiac output or CO is the one minute average of your muscle strength. Cardiac index is CO based on the SA. The stroke volume or SV is the per beat strength, as SVI is based on the SA. RVSWI describes the right ventricular strength based on the SA. LVSWI describes the left ventricular strength based on the SA. Interpreting the afterload parameters. Afterload describes the forward flow resistance of the blood. It also describes size of the patient's vascular bed. The higher the afterload parameter is, the more constricted the patient is. If the parameter is below normal it means that the patient is dilated. SVR and SVRI describes the vascular bed size in the periphery. PVR and PVRI describes the vascular bed size in the pulmonary area. Other hemocalc helpful tabs. The reference tab. The terms of use tab. The equations used tab. The Terminology tab. The Feedback and Support tab. The Developer Information tab. For technical support, please contact us at criticalcarewizard.com forward slash contact underscore us.aspx. Thank you for purchasing our product HemoCalc.